He would often wear this version when training in order to protect his waist. Or he made a lighter version so he could wear it all the time and show it off. <laughs> True. Maybe. Pa pa possibly. Perhaps. Perchance. Probably. Is there anything else we can check out here? Oh, we can just... You know what? I, I'm, I'm still in your seat. I'm still in your seat. No! <laughs> the powder still needs some time to settle. So let's wait a little longer. <laughs> I was gonna say, <laughs> sitting on the chair, I was gonna say, Welcome to my office, Archon. What brings you here? Well, God dang it. what do you think of my collection? Do you feel like you have a better understanding of Natland's culture now? Hmm, kinda, yeah, sure. Yeah, if each item represents a different story, seems like Natland's really been through a lot. Does every item hold a special memory, just like Atea's talisman? That's right. The items in my collection actually serve a similar purpose to the ancient names passed down among the tribes. They demonstrate the true shape of time. The shape of time? Most people perceive time as a linear concept, almost like a straight line that can only move forward. We cannot change the past or predict the future. But there's also a different theory, one that I believe to be closer to the truth. Namely, that the past present and future all exist at once mm. at once Paimon's not sure she understands <laughs> uh, let's say your I know that sounds right a bit weird now. thinking back on your experience in each nation which one would you say was the most important uh, I have to say all of them I mean the biggest revolution that we Probably got what's most likely like in Sumeru, probably. I I would say like yeah. I I th I think in Sumeru, but I have to say all of them. Exactly. Even at the end of your journey, the things you experienced along the way don't cease to exist. They become part of who you are take out a portion of that journey and you would likely make very different decisions and eventually arrive at a very different destination the future is the same way it exists even though it has yet to come to pass we just lack the means to perceive it of course there are those with the power to foresee the future they simply call it by a different name fate you're quite familiar with that concept, I would imagine. Uh, yeah. Quite, quite well, actually. Uh, that does kind of make sense. The future hasn't happened, but already exists. Humanity excels at living in the present, but too often we forget the past and neglect the future. So ancient names record uh, the past. While the pilgrimage and the night warden wars lead us to a better future. Only by uniting the people of Natlan across countless eras can we fight back against an enemy as formidable as the Abyss. To come up with such a set of rules, the first Pyro Archon must have possessed a level of insight I can only imagine. So, the first Pyro Archon created the rule of Natlan? That's correct. At first, he was a mortal man with no special power. After he ascended to the Divine Throne, he used it to borrow power from the heavens and establish the rules of Natlan. Namely, a framework through which ordinary people can ascend to Archonhood. By holding the pilgrimage, we're able to determine the strongest among us. And when that person ascends um, to the um, divine uh, throne, um, yeah. their inner flame will awaken. In addition, the sacred flame will grant them significant knowledge and memory of this land, 
After all, that's how I came to know everything I just told you. Cool. So, it all comes down to the no. power of the Divine Throne and the rules. Wait, is that a family portrait? What the? <laughs> what? I thought she fell down. Uh, uh, pa pa Paimon, are you, are you, bu are you bugging? Pa Paimon, are you, are you okay? You, you're, 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 you, are you stuck in what is going on? <laughs> yes. <gasps> That's my mother, father, younger sister, and the little Saurians we raised. Oh, That's cool. Damn. I know for some reason, no, she doesn't look that much like. No, because I was thinking she looked a little bit like Vanessa. But. Mm, does she? Yeah, she looks a little. Nah, never mind. I mean, just the red hair, probably. I turned a piece of my dad's leather armor into a canvas and commissioned a famous artist to paint our likeness. Your sister is so cute! Two of you are really close. Don't don't ask where she now. What happened? I was having a hard time thinking of an archon as an ordinary person, but seeing this portrait, it kind of makes sense now. It really doesn't look like there was anything special about you before. Oh wait, is Paimon allowed to say that? <laughs> now Paimon is getting burned. A little late for that question, don't you think? You're cooked, Paimon. Alright, we're eating emergency food. Sorry! Paimon's so sorry! Paimon's mouth works faster than her brain sometimes! Same. <laughs> it's alright. I'd never get upset over something like that. Paimon and I have, like, almost equal IQ. No matter what Paimon others might have may a little say, bit more. my past <laughs> is a precious part of my identity. I'm forever proud of the life I used to lead. Becoming the Archon doesn't mean you sever ties with your family. The position just comes with a lot of responsibilities, so it impacts how often you get to see them. My father made the most delicious stew, so my sister would often bring me a large pot of his cooking, and we would sit on a blanket and eat it together. Nice. So, now I really want to know where they are, or, or you know, are we going to meet them? One time, we didn't or close the door securely, and the Saurians who were raising ran into the room and knocked over the Something entire happened. pot. Something bad happened. My sister immediately burst into tears. The two troublemakers were going for the meat, but when they saw my sister's distress, they froze on the spot. Very thumbnail worthy. Thank you. I still remember the way they laid there, sulking like a pair of children, even after making such a mess. It was frustrating, but in the end, all I could do was comfort my sister and move on. Wow. You forgave them just like that? Isn't that what being a family is all about? <laughs> I think about that story a lot, actually. As the Archon, I made a vow to defend this nation, and experiences like that... They remind me exactly what I'm trying to protect. Well, what happened after that? This portrait looks pretty old. Your sister must be all grown up by now, right? Ooh, here we go. I believe she ended up working as an architect and artist. Oh. She built many houses and crafted many beautiful works of art. Anyway, that's enough about me. Now that the powder is settled, we can begin. Iansan, Mulani, Chaska, over here, please. Well, she said used to, didn't she? Wait, hold on. She said used to. Or it. Wait, wait, hold on. Oh, you can. As the Archon, oh, I made a vow to look. defend this. I believe she ended up working as an architect and artist. She built many houses and crafted many beautiful works of art. I believe she ended up working as a. She built many houses and crafted many builds with beautiful. Um. I don't know. 
I feel like they changed the Pyro Oracle quite a lot. I don't know why. It's uh, well, not. I don't. Not why, but I just felt like it. Because otherwise, I mean, she would outlive her whole family. <laughs> I mean, she would outlive everybody. But still, um, I don't. I don't know. Uh, do you guys think she's alive? I think. I think she's. 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 She's gone. Place the ancient name up there, and then we'll begin. Alright. I'm ready. Are you guys ready? Let's go. Oh! Oh, you have to be um, dramatic. Okay. Dramatic. Let's go. Everyone ready? Are you guys ready? Here we go. <clears throat> Surely as the echoes of life resound through heaven and earth, so too shall our stories remain eternal. Ancient name, take us to your fated bearer. Allow her to answer our call. Kachina, it's just us. We're trying to find a way to bring you back. Everyone, you have to listen to me. What's going on? I've been investigating the Night Kingdom this entire time, and I figured out what's wrong. The Wyab is being affected by the Abyss. Oh. I was waiting for the Wyab to send me back, but then this really strong monster came in and almost killed me. Almost, at least. The Night Kingdom has become a huge mess, though. I keep hearing these awful sounds and seeing really horrible things. Oh no, my baby gonna need therapy after this. Don't listen to those sounds, Kachina. The Abyss is trying to strip you of your sanity. All you need to do is stay safe and wait for us. We'll be there shortly. Just stay calm. Just be safe. the chance to talk to you guys you don't need to worry about me but we are I've never been strong or special at all really so I don't blame anyone for forgetting about me or leaving me behind <laughs> just knowing you care is more than enough stop it can you guys stop it with this already I'm I'm so I'm I'm I'm, I'm done with this sobbing stuff man stop I, I get it I get it I get it in danger to come rescue me you're always like this kachina now's not the time to act tough we're coming for you and that's final i don't know what lies the abyss has been feeding you but i'll tell you something right now nobody here sees you as a burden you're a victor of the night warden wars a hero of natlan mm -hmm, mm -hmm, all you mm -hmm. need to do is wait for us to rescue you and you'll get all the applause and recognition you deserve. No, oh, my baby. I'm, I'm really scared. Everything's so dark and creepy here. And I want to go home. Still, I don't want you to put your All you need to do is place your trust in us, just like you always have. No one fights alone. We're not leaving you behind. Not ever. Yeah, we're so close, we can't call it quits now. 
Mhm, mm mhm. Mm Looks like we've lost contact. Now comes the most dangerous part. You have to traverse the Night Kingdom in your physical form. We got this, no problem. You know who we are? We fought we we fought the literal Raiden Shogun, okay? Sure, we we had a, a lot of, a, a lot a lot lots of help, but I mean I have a we're not fighting alone. That's right. This entrance to the Night Kingdom was left behind after an abyssal invasion. Even a brief amount of time inside could expose you to corrosion. For some reason, I feel like we are very resistant. I know. Just because we I'm don't. Prepared for uh, that possibility. We, we, the rules of this world don't really apply to us that much. All right. Then I wish you all the best. I'll tell Koichi to be ready just in case. She's very experienced in dealing with abyssal corruption. That face you just made. Don't tell me you two got into another argument. <laughs> no, I just feel bad for creating more work for her. I'll go with them too, Archon. The more people, the stronger the party. Right. Thank you so much for your help, everyone. It really means a lot that you're willing to brave these dangers with me. And there's no time to lose, so let's get going. Now that I've lost my power, I won't be able to provide much practical support. But I can still keep an eye on the situation from here. I don't get... What do you mean by lost your power? Do you mean literally lost your power? I mean, I assume that's what it, what she means. Um, I'm just dumb, but... It's like... Because I thought that... She would give away some of her power, not all of it. What? Eon-san, I know it's unlikely, but if you encounter a situation you can't handle... That won't happen. I hope not. <laughs> okay, here we go. Hmm. Never mind, yep, Nuvi is tall, tall. Oh my. He is so freaking tall. <laughs> I forgot how tall I said. I was like, "Damn, she's really tall." I mean, she's she is really tall, but yeah, she's <laughs> yeah, she's she's pretty tall, man. But not no no, I'm taller. <laughs> All right, let's go. Or let's see what she's gonna is she gonna say anything. Be careful out there. I'll observe the situation from here. All right. All right, I'll see you around. Bleh. Oh wait, I have to check out something. Hold on, guys. Oh my! I'm so sorry. I had to check. <laughs> I had, I bro, I had to check the cost. I had to check it, cause all the memes, and it's true. It's actually true. I'm sorry if you find this offensive, bro. It's a game, okay, but. I'm a sh I, 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 <laughs> it goes all the way around, it goes all the way around, what is this costume? Rem remnant of the secret source, the soul path to the night kingdom, once home to an ancient dragon kin kind, now reduced to ruin. Influenced by the abyss, the site harbors many unforeseen dangers. Fire. I like how we're still just in Natlan. Natlan just started. But I'm already thinking of the high for Sneshnaya, how that's gonna be, and we're gonna meet it to Ther Theresa. Oh my god. Oh, the FPS. Oh my god. God, my eyes just like melted. Oh, oh, oh! Is this how you guys play the game all the time? Oh. I'm jealous. I'm jealous. Oh my God, my eyes are a little bit. Oh my God! I have a six hertz monitor, so <laughs> um, you know. But for you guys who are watching at higher frame rate, I think. Uh, oh well, it's. I'm it will help a little bit, but more of like an FPS game, I guess. So 
smooth. So smooth. Oh, I'm about to cry. So we're underneath Natland right now? It looks nothing like Paimon was imagining. That's because in the distant past, Natlin was home to an incredibly advanced civilization ruled by dragons. Humans only established their own society after the fall of the dragons. Ah, oh, my ears. So these are Saurian ruins? I don't think she's talking about the Saurians. I think she means actual dragons. Would it be that surprising? Yes, a really long time ago. Very few records have survived until now, so no one really knows what the devices here are for. I mean, I, I, I to me at least, that wouldn't really, like, <laughs> it wouldn't surprise me that much that they did. These ruins have been abandoned for a long time, but with the recent increase in Abyss activity, the installations around here have somehow been activated again. So what you're saying is... We're not in for an easy trip to the Night Kingdom. Nothing is easy. <laughs> no. It's going to be obstacle after obstacle from here on out. <laughs> <laughs> Just what I wanted to hear. It's the pre-adventure excitement kicking in, right guys? Of course. I'm eager to get started. Adventure, live for a moment like these. Then let's go. We won't let anything stand in our way. I would love to try to the other characters too, but I don't think they have fixed it, you know, them yet. But otherwise, I think we would definitely uh, be playing them as well right, right now as a trial. At least, like, one. One more. Off we go. I still wish I would have Milani trial on because I don't have her build yet. Seems Ooh. like the road ends here. How should we get across? Like this. Yoink. As a professional trainer, I think you could stand to build up your endurance, Paimon. Professional trainer? Paimon thought you were a warrior Ooh. from the Collective of Plenty. Well. That goes without saying. But I actually work as a sports coach. I provide professional guidance for many of Natland's popular sports. And I don't just mean physical training. I design nutrition plans as well. Ah, so basically no sugar, no soft drinks, no grilled meat. Yeah, yeah, we'll be here all day if you list them out one by one. It's much faster to just focus on what's good for you. Such as? Vegetable juice. Mm. I'm just, I just want to listen to what they say before I go. The two of us might not see eye to eye. There you go. Because I feel like they might like end up like cutting short of a conversation. Which Those I don't guys want look to. familiar. We've fought oh. them before. Let's go. Show no mercy. <laughs> what? The... Wait. Do we have any fireballs? Come on. What's the point? God dang it! No fireball. Whatever. Oh, Hi guys. Okay, well, it's still lagging here. The tides beckon. Bong. I'm here to reclaim my home. Get the frick away from here. Get away. Well, no, this this place wouldn't be a place that uh, Nuvelet would have um, been in, though. I mean, wait, what? Oh, it's you! Oh, it's you! It's you! It's you! It's you. Just because he's... I don't think he's that Whoa. old enough. The place we need to go seems really high up. I remember Nivellet is old, but not that old. Like, the oldest character that we know of is most likely... If we don't, if we skip the Primordial one, it's probably gonna be young Wee. He's like, I don't know. Bow your head. 
How old was he? Like 8,000 years old? Bro, it's old. <laughs> 